start. Ooh. This is a classic. Yeah, he could absolutely maul them, mate. Banana could be an abattoir. He's firing off the shots. Does shoot over the head and Steel will swing to at least shut down John G. But you're left in a 3v3. Flash on the getaway. Gets stuck behind New Box, but he still tucks oh. in. Woo! Second oranges for one. And then he falls. That first kill is actually so important. He's just only got the one shot he was able to get off before he goes down. Lands the headshot to make it a two versus two. Viz is going aggressive towards back hole. He finds Fasten trying to go for the retake. So now it's all on Yeps. He's 1v2. Looking in, seeing if he can find anything towards Coffins. Hasn't found him yet. The reposition's already there. He's pushed in towards his close left. As soon as he gets contact, the swing should come in from the teammate, but it's not going to matter. Ben Leet doesn't need it. And yesterday, Jack, this another tag, and he gets away with his life. So he's going to get a chance to take more shots here as the Deagle raining out through the smoke finds a bit of damage onto Ben Leet. And now there is Dart, big man. <laughs> How long do you think we should, we should just keep calling him Dart for? As long as it goes. <laughs> I like it. Yeah. I think it's always fun. My favorite one's when you get someone called Cat. Yeah, Ooh. Cat's a good one. As they get control of top middle, there is one man over there towards long. That's Fasten. He's going aggressive, wants to get just a bit of information, and the only information he gets is that DJ's there with a gun waiting Ooh. to shoot him. Ben Lee swings out, does connect the headshot with the Tech 9. Looked a little bit dicey there for a moment, as Yeps does trade it back. The bomb has made its way into CT spawn, though, and Yeps is getting sandwiched. They're springing upon him. Yaps trying to say oh. no, but it's not going to work as DJ will leave him low to the ground. And this is not ideal. Always yeah. thinking about the plays you used to be able to make with a Famous, man. They damage coming out. And this is a fast play from Honda down middle. They have spotted it out by the looks of it as Jonji does get the kill. This time not going aggressive towards Banana. DJ swinging out in mid. Finds Yaps playing aggressive. The boost on B. Now they know there's two players at B. The reaction from PA should be to take top mid control right now. Unlucky. Yeah, not great. Slows him down somewhat. This is clean, though. DJ on the drive-by. This is just the MP9, man. He's so fast. You can see he just couldn't track him. He ran no. across the screen so quickly. Breezing. Last player left alive in steel. He's got a tasty-looking deagle. It's going to work up as well. Pulls out the M4, but then Lee posted on the angle. And Valve made that initial ragdoll change a couple months ago and you'd shoot someone in the knee and they would just do a backflip. Oh yeah. That was so much fun. It was sad when they toned it down. I'm yeah. glad they left it oh. at least in the place it is. This is all right though. The place they're in, you have at least made it somewhat costly, right? I mean, Ben's down. Pone alone. He's fallen over. But Viz will be able to find the heads. It's just on Yeps. USP, nepping up towards Banana, and that will be only RCF. He's only really in a position where he should be able to find one, at best, two frags, and with a trade, now they're getting aggressive towards the bottom of Banana. RCF with the first, but he eventually falls on the frag back. Bit paranoid about another player being on the site. With only seven seconds left, they need to plant. Yeah, they get the bomb down just in time. Ponalone also found Fasten on the flank. That was a nice shot, so two versus three. That op is dropped in the back of the B site as well, so no real chance to recover it. But Case wants to go for this. They don't want to concede this fifth round for nothing. Molotov's coming in. They do find the kill onto DJ. Now they know there's one player here towards the new box. That nade is going to do so much Ooh. damage. He fights out. They know they're both there. They swing, but they don't swing together. But it's not going to matter. Out of bullets and yeps. And Ponalone peeks the right. Finds the two there. Could have been a difference. Well, I'm surprised. He threw the nade in towards new box. And DJ did swing out that left side. I think one bullet connecting would have been enough for the kill. But maybe the nade smoke sort of blocked his vision. I'm not sure. Like right there. I'm yeah. surprised Honda wasn't able to get one of those kills. Realistically, he should have. That, that, and that just would have changed everything. Astronauts. Good re-entry as they came back from orbit into the B site. And John G, he's still going sky high. Pushes up into CT, forks on the chin, sprints straight towards CT, finds Honda, he's gonna get into a car crash, and now it starts to get rough as they're going bold and brash into the B site. RCF on the flank, scopes in, hits the pickup, Straight back from Yeps, and they've tried to shut this down, cauterize the bleeding, but Viz is still here. He's going full high, Viz. Wants to be the center of attention. Knows that he can recover the bomb if he makes the play, but with 20 seconds left, it's going to be desperation. Walks across. Cubby play for the Orpa. Wrap round towards CT as well. Peek out, hits the first. Jumps in the air. Trying to jump for joy, but it's not going to work as RCF peeks from the noise. Hits him with a USP. What did the player? It doesn't look like he has. Now he has for sure. As he peeks out, he knows there's a player close as well, and Viz is just sort of stuck in this corner. He doesn't have any help. Honda finds Jonji, and this is going to be all starting to fall apart. I say that as DJ gets the trade back onto Honda. So does Viz know there's a player? Worst thing in the world for him. Yep.
You always see him at events just hitting leaves. I know, it's weird. He was walking around the hotel. I saw a video, you know, it was one of the content pieces. You guys haven't seen it yet, don't worry. It's coming. But he was just walking by and just knocking over, yeah. like, flower pots and trees. And it's ridiculous. Yeah, no, he was, he sort of, he was, like, trimming trees inside. He's like, what are you doing? Yeah. As well. So 48 seconds on the clock. They're going to oh, hold no. behind it, but look at the rotate coming in. He's got his back turned because he has the util in his hands. It's not going to work wonders for them. RTF with <gasps> the orbit is the shot. He's basically nutmegged them. Shot between the both. They can now sprint back round towards A, and that's where Honda's lying in wait. DT's how proud. He wanted to make them proud. He did. But instead here, it's going to be half to Honda. That makes Case proud. He does drop the smoke and saves out from the molly. But the problem is he's only got one. Finds a second before he goes down. Ben will batter him and can get the bomb planted. And 3v2 post plant again and does Case go for this. Pone alone has the angle. He's creeping around. It's going to come down to the timing and steal. Able to connect the shots onto the side of the body but not able to find the head. And Pone alone's gun, well that kills with one. To be. And they want to have a battle, but instead it'll only be one man left to hold it. That's John G. Everyone else going back down mid. They peek into the scope. RCF fires off a shot, hits the first. Honda on the stairs, going to be decking everyone that comes towards him. Sets up for oh. more, and it's an easy spray. One, two, three. It felt a bit overzealous. There is a balcony attack from Honda as well in the bedroom. He's had an all-nighter. He's starting to get scrappy. <laughs> John G through the smoke. Goodbye, Honda. Switches to the tech. Farsin was in position. So he's able to battle back from arch side. Yep, push up, blocks the smoke, and still hits the shot onto DJ as well. So they've now whittled the numbers back down to a 2v2. Minute on the clock. Rotate comes in from the tees. They're heading back to B. But Ben, he holds. Over here, that's fine. Then he can come over. Now they just stick together. They push in. They are going to get that bomb planted. Smoke comes out towards Moto. It's a little bit deep. And Fasten's in front of it, but the Molotov very heavy. They're doing a bit, but the flash is good. Full blinds John G has to fall back into the CT smoke. They are taking a ton of damage, Jack, but no one's dying. They're not finding any kills. Ben does eventually get one, but he's traded from RCF. And now it's the 4v4 retake, and again, they don't have that kit. Oh, John G, though, might not need a kit because he's right behind them. Just goes charging straight forward, hits the follow-up as well, punishes the pool player. And now this looks horrendous. You're in a one versus two. It's all up to John G to do the damage. Goes straight into new box. Suspicious of Honda's face. That's three frags, and he wants to turn it into the 4K. Oh, close, but no succumb. And there's three CTs here, but this is going to be the hit, and the Molotov's going to force them out. Push comes to shove. Molotov burns John G. Ben Leak with a fast adjustment. Can't quite commit to the spam to get the kill, but Viz might. He'll peek out. Kills from Coffins. They're forced back to struggling, oh! but suddenly he comes alive. Annihilates them with a hand cannon. And it's all on steel. 20 seconds, one versus three. Suspicious of the peak onto CT. If he faces out, he could get one dig. Instead, it's just a tag to slow him down. And now he's being battered all around. <laughs> DJ will do him in. He up close on the car. Flash is good to push them off, but he needs to fall back now. His team has to rotate over. There's no smoke in CT spawn. Ben is aware of the aggression, though. Finds the kill onto Steel, as now the CT smoke is there. Spray raining out. This is going to be the five versus four retake, but like I said, a ton of utility held onto here by the CTs. Flashes, Molotov to go out. They just need to wait out these smokes as even more damage is being found. Apparently, they don't need the smokes to be gone. They'll just shoot straight for them and still find tags. Honda, though, he goes aggro towards Garden. But they're going to be able to shut that down. Leaves it just on Farsin. He's got the Deagle peak CT. Felt like it should have been a one tap on the first. But losing out on that one, suddenly you're completely outnumbered. He'll fall. And party astronauts get themselves first. Steel. Steel. Oh, <laughs> eyes like a hawk waiting for the face, but it won't matter. As his teammate boosting him has been battered. There's the response, but the Molotov's underneath him. So hot feet. He's out. And Ben Lee at the back of the site should get the easy pickings onto the last player now is supported by Pone alone. No matter what happens here, you've only got nine seconds. He'd have to do something audacious. Tries to get the bomb plant, baits them in first, hits the headshot. All right, maybe there's an opportunity. Two seconds, he's got a sprint in and the timing's not going to work. Nope, he just needs to get away. Viz real Who as well, crucially. All comes down to this then. 35 seconds, they leap out of the apartments. One for one trade as Honda will hit his first. All of the CTs coming up large and everyone's being able to shut them down. It's just Honda left, hits a headshot. 25 seconds, advances forward. He's got to get the bomb and he's got to get the kills. He's being swung on as well from John G. And John G, he doesn't <laughs> let go of W. Sadly for the party astronauts, two players towards the top of Banana, they're dedicating to it. 
So they just have these two, one in pit, one in sight. Ben Lee actually with the FAMAS creeping around the corner, finds the headshot onto Fasten. Viz now dropping the smoke into pit. Gonna try to keep himself alive for as long as he can. Counter smoke on short as well. Good counter what? utility and through the smoke. Viz doesn't even see him. We barely even saw what happened. He finds two before DJ ends it and that's it. That is the end of the game. I'm there with my head on my hands thinking, how on earth has Ben one out on that engagement? The